Hi, my name is Carol Epp and this is my studio and I'm a ceramic artist based in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan and I've just recently had an exhibition open at the Mendel Art Gallery called The Politics of Innocent Dreams. So I started working in ceramics back when I was doing my undergrad at the University of Regina and studying with Ruth Chambers, Jack Suarez and Rory McDonald and was really inspired while I was there to look at ceramics and craft practice um, in a broader sense which also incorporated a lot of conceptual um, sort of subject matter for, uh, for the work. So whether it be conceptual subject matter about craft practice or just different subject matter throughout, um, taken from the world that I wanted to deal with. Um, they really sort of broadened my perspectives about what clay could be. And so that was back in 90, about 98 that I started working in clay. And it really became sort of a relationship where um, I fell in love with clay immediately and have really never looked back on any other materials since. I started working with subject matter that I felt needed to sort of be voiced through a more figurative tableau and um, I was trying to sort of position myself as an artist in relation to the subject matter I was dealing with and I found that my voice as an artist and as a person in relation to some of the more political or controversial subject matter I was dealing with was as a consumer and so I was looking for consumer um, mass-produced objects that I could sort of um, frame my sort of standpoint in relation to the work and so I, I started working with the kitsch objects at that point because they for me were the symbol of um, not only mass consumerism but also stereotypes and ideologies that were potentially kind of false and and almost like propaganda of of idealized ways of living and so I sort of worked to subvert those to bring in more charged political subject matter um, in a way that just sort of undermined the originals but sort of allowed still the viewer that comfort zone of something that they could they could relate to in that kitsch object. 